Inventions have impact when they reach people through products. Jerry Lemelson recognized that, and it was part of his motivation in creating the foundation. Inventors need a path to take their ideas forward into products and businesses. For the inventor's pathway, it starts with somebody being inspired that there's a problem worth solving, educating them in a way that enables them, and then helping to create an incubation environment where the idea incubates to a product that can reach people through a business. Inspiration means that people feel the desire, the opportunity for them to actually become inventors, to take part in that creative process through invention. It really is about sparking the imagination and sparking creativity. We want young people to feel that moment of discovery in some way, to see that invention could be a way of life. It really is about seeing that transformation that comes when a young person suddenly considers themselves a problem solver. When the light sparks and they think, oh, I, I suppose I can do this. It's also really important for every child to have the opportunity to recognize they can become an inventor. And for those for whom that's a good match, they have the opportunity through an educational process to actually turn that into reality. There is a need to really think much more holistically about the educational system and whether the system is in fact safe for invention. What is it about invention education that goes beyond just learning how to become an inventor and really teaches kids how to be a successful student, how to be a successful learner? It's creating opportunities for students to learn about the process of being an inventor and how to take an idea and make it into something scalable. Especially for young inventors starting out, finding a good community of fellow inventors and a support system for their ideas is critical. InventTeam had an effect on my education that I don't think any other program really could have. It, it exposed me to real engineering problems and, and allowed me to create with a team and, and see my own ideas come into reality. We focus on incubation because we need to cultivate good ideas that are coming from the next generation inventors and provide them a supporting environment in which they can be turned into products and businesses with impact. The Lemelson Foundation emphasizes incubation, giving networks to people, giving them mentors and access to resources to help them move along. You can be much more effective at incubation if they're educated and how they're actually thinking about problem solving and how they can take their actual talents and put them into use no matter what environment they are. My customer is the inventor. And that means that we should do everything that's required to make them succeed. So provide them with adequate funding, give them excellent mentoring, provide them with an amazing enabling network so that once you're in there, you concentrate on your invention. With their help, we were able to fund our first four prototypes. It's the, the people that take interest in it, like Lemelson, that you know, just provides that moral support that's, that's invaluable. Obviously, every invention doesn't work, and there's a lot of failure along the way. Failure is not failure unless you don't learn from it. Here, it's a big stigma if you fail. We have to have that failure first to see the, the ultimate solution. As long as they are learning and they're stepping forward, the Foundation has continued to provide support to allow them to grow and to flourish. Support from the Lemelson Foundation gives us that space to figure these issues out. We're seeing evidence that, in fact, incubation and, and nurturing them and supporting them does truly build good quality enterprises all over the world. I'd like to see the next 20 years bring more attention paid to the pathway. People are aware of the importance of each of those elements. But in fact, the pathway is what's critical, and that the environment for supporting an invention becomes stronger and stronger. We're just, you know, humbled, proud, you know, delighted to play a small role in this wonderful chain that started with, you know, one man's portfolio of inventions and his inventiveness, and how that's now impacting so many million lives.